it. So for your seasoning for the turkey, you're gonna do one stick of salted butter and two tablespoons of poultry seasoning. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add that right on top. Warm this over medium heat until that butter is melted. All right, so now we have the butter and the poultry seasoned. I know it looks really thick, but you're gonna be fine. So now we're gonna take the, uh, I have a little brush here. We'll brush the outside of the turkey with this solution. This will help us during the browning process. But before we do that, I wanna take a little bit of this, get it on my glove, and I'm going to take it and massage it into the breast of the turkey underneath that skin. Remember we made that skin pocket whenever we were prepping the turkey to go in the brine. Done um, adding the season to the exterior of the turkey. Now we're gonna preheat our oven at 500 degrees. While our oven is preheating and our seasoning is kind of marinating on the exterior and underneath the skin of the turkey, um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some celery and white onion and just stuff it in the cavity of the turkey. And again, if you do like to stuff your turkey, just be mindful that um, you'll have, it takes a little bit longer for that stuffing to cook. We're 14 minutes, I'm sorry, uh, 13 minutes per, per pound after we do the exterior browning. And I've taken some skewers that I've just cut down. And I like for my wings to be tucked back into the body of the turkey. So I'm gonna take that, pierce the wing, and I'm just gonna tuck it right in to my my leg. And then we'll take this out, of course, once we get done. But this is just how I like to keep it neat. And it's not flopping all over the place. So just go in and then you're gonna put it right into your leg. So now we're gonna transfer it to the pan uh, that we're going to be cooking our turkey in. I have a good old glass Pyrex dish that I love to cook with. So we're gonna take our turkey and place them right in there, nice and neat. And the skin here, um, since I stuffed it uh, with the vegetables, I'm just gonna tuck it in here so my vegetables don't fall out. The oven's still preheating and you can see there's still some bits of where our butter is hardening at. If you don't want to be wasteful like me, I'm just going to scrape a little bit more of that. It smells so amazing. Just dump it right here in the center or anywhere where I may have missed a spot um, of that when I was doing the exterior. We're at 500 degrees. Now it's time to take our turkey and place it in the oven. So now our turkey's going in the oven on 500 degrees for 30 minutes. This is gonna brown the exterior of our turkey. Okay, Google, set a timer for 30 minutes. Sure, 30 minutes, starting now. Turkey's been roasting in the oven on 500 degrees for 30 minutes. Now we're gonna reduce the temperature of the oven down to 350 degrees. And you can see this butter. Our butter solution in there. You want, you can rub a little bit more of that. So good, it smells so good. The poultry seasoning. Oh, this looks good. 
So now what we're gonna do is tint over the turkey, the foil, and put it back in the oven, 350 degrees, 13 minutes per pound, until we reach the internal temperature of 161 degrees. Got the turkey tenant, we've got our thermometer stuck in the thickest part of the breast meat, and we're putting it back in the oven on 350 degrees for 13 minutes per pound or until we reach 161 degrees internally. Came out of the oven uh, when it reached the internal temperature of 161. Um, and here is I'm just monitoring the temperature. It's been sitting tinted for about 30 minutes. And it has an internal temperature right now of uh, 159. So it's cooled off a little bit, but it's ready for carving. There's two things you can do with it. You can use it to baste on your turkey, or you can make a gravy with it. It's fantastic smells delicious now when I'm gonna get ready to plate this on my platter but don't forget to remove your skewers from it as well you can see the juice is running out of there so awesome.